Hello, good morning, welcome. I am Sim UK. This is Elite Dangerous, and oh my god, chapter 4, part 3.3 has arrived. And we're going to take a little look at it today. Very excited. I've already had a little spin around because it's quite a big day. Hello, guys, in chat, by the way. Sorry, um, I. I just realised the counter hit zero and I was just chatting away to you two. <laughs> I do apologise. Started a little bit slowly there, but we're up and running now. So um, I have spent... Well, it's been a busy... Let, let me just say, it's been a busy 24 hours. So yesterday I was working like a crazy man trying to get the uh, the Insurgency Sandstorm review completed so that I could stream it... Uh, Pre premiere it live this morning at 10 a.m which i did and about 10 people turned up so thank you everybody who turned up and watched um hopefully that's a a review video that's useful to you if you're interested in uh, or thinking about buying the insurgency sandstorm title which releases later today um so if you haven't watched that definitely go check that out but in order to accomplish that i was working like a crazy man last night yesterday my daughter um, did her karate exam for her red belt and she got it yes i love her she's so cool and um yeah so that was a uh, very exciting but um took a you know obviously took a bit of time so i was up until 3 a.m this morning 3 a.m editing and finishing that video and the wife is not talking to me now she's not a happy bunny i kept her awake as well so i could get this video finished so it's been a stressful morning, a uh, stressful 24 hours, I guess. But we've got some exceptionally good news. At least I think I have. Because I just ran a test recording using this current setup. And you won't believe this, guys, right? I'm starting to think it's all my problems are coming from the Logitech gaming software profile. But I don't know for sure. More testing is required. Let's see if this works. Oh my god, look at that. Left hand, right hand. Can you believe it? Cameras on the stream. It's never happened before, guys. Not only that, we've got the SciTech side panel hooked up today. So that's running. That now is our landing mechanism. And because we've um, upgraded to chapter 4, 3.3, there's like um, at least... I think at least five additional buttons that have been added to the game that didn't exist at all. 3 a.m. Yes, I know I'm mad, Andrew. I know I'm mad. But go and watch the review. It was a, a labor of passion. I had to get it done. But um, just out of interest, because we haven't really had cameras. Logitech, that wouldn't surprise you. It doesn't flip in surprise. I had, Seriously, I've been a Logitech fanboy for so many years and when they bought SciTech I was very excited I thought oh brilliant they're going to improve the SciTech side panel they're going to improve the x56 they're going to improve all this cool stuff they haven't done anything they're just money grabbing scumbags and none of their stuff works properly it's intrusive and it's CPU demanding it's I, I'm starting to really dislike Logitech which is a real pain in the ass because both these cameras are Logitech, you and you, poke you in the nose, they're both Logitech cameras. Uh, up until recently I've been running Logitech everything. My mouse is a Logitech 502, uh, I've just got a Corsair K55 keyboard, but other than that I've been running Logitech for years. Um, they look good in, on stream, very little lag. Yeah, well this one here is bloody expensive. This one is like 80 quid, and it's meant for streaming. Um, and this one over here, I've got such a good deal on this one. Uh, that's normally like 60 quid or whatever. I picked it up for £25 brand new in um, the Black Friday sale. So I'm quite happy that I've got two. I thought having two Logitech cameras would fix all my problems, but it hasn't done so far. But um, yeah, I mean, how does that look, guys? Can you see it okay? Because I've got some additional lights I can fire up. I was just trying to go for mood. Let me fire up the additional lights so you can tell me what looks better. Oh, 
Only concern that doesn't look so good, does it? Now it looks like I've got a messy desk. Whereas before it kind of looked cool like a spaceship. But um yeah, the only concern with whacking those lights on is that my head tracking might work. Because apparently, as per my test just now, even my head tracking works today, which is just unprecedented. I'm gonna turn those off. I think that looks better. Oh, gosh. How is everybody today? You all right? Feeling all Christmassy and stuff? Two weeks. Two weeks. <laughs> Two weeks and Santa will be here. I'm super excited. My little one's quite excited as well. You think more lights looks better? Good afternoon, Toph. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today, buddy? You think more more light looks better? Okay, let's. I can I can adjust them. So let me turn it on so that you can see, but not so bright that it looks cack. So bear with me. How's that looking? It's a bit brighter. Hopefully you can see uh, left hand is pretty good. Right hand is acceptable. And this is the center panel. Does that look all right? You're embroidering this afternoon. So you're catching some stream. Good Lord. What are you embroidering, Andrew? Lights are up to me. Well, as long as you guys can see and it's not too dingy and dark. Hope I'm well despite my late night. So far, I'm okay. I've got an absolutely essential coffee right over here. That's keeping me going right now. Chocky biscuit, if it gets too bad, we'll be okay. We'll be all right. Uh, <clears throat> oh, v, sorry, dude, I'm quitting this stream. It's very, I mean, laggy here. Better do a YouTube stream that you can reach more viewers. Sorry about that, buddy. J try and join us next week. I'll see if I can get a, a like a multi-stream going or something. Apologies. Okay, guys. Right. Um, so I've I've watched a few videos. Um, I'm I'm on solo play today just because I'm going to be looking more at stuff rather than sort of paying attention to what I'm doing. But my God, doesn't this look vibrant and alive? It's like somebody's turned the lights on. Which is kind of uh, relevant to what we've just been talking about. But this looks absolutely sensational. I'm going to have to do something with my head tracking. Not today. Sorry if you can hear that. I won't do it today. Damn, this game sounds good. Company wants some three-in-one coats made up. Good lord. Are you a tailor, Andrew? There's an art to that. There's a real art to that. Okay, let's get our butt cheeks. Uh, oh, actually, no, 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 it's not get our butt cheeks off let's go back to starport services sorry we'll see if we can find a job or a contract or something along those lines mission board what have we got 102,000 credits guys we've nearly got enough to buy a ship where do i buy ships from where do i buy ships from Okay, that's a genuine question. Where do, you're a garment decorator. Ah, cool. That's twitchy for you at times. Where where do I buy a ship from, guys? Where do I need to go?
Not in outfitting, surely. Or maybe so. I was going to entitle this stream um, Trading for a Hauler because I'd like to buy a new ship today. But uh, I don't know where to buy one. I've never bought a ship on on uh, Elite Dangerous. I don't know what I'm doing. A complete noob to this. Uh, okay, let's go to Mission Board and see if we can get a job that's sort of nearby. Assassinate Pirate Lord Ian Micklethwaite. Yeah, we're not quite ready for that. Uh, microcontrollers, that's not so good. What do we got here? Assassination, assassination, liberation. Liberate one bootleg of liquor. That sounds illegal. We're not ready for that yet. Assassinate, assassinate. Oh my god. This is a dangerous planet. Massacre. Acellus Primus Purple Crew Faction Pirates. Massacre. Not assassinate. Massacre. Good lord. Destruction of something or other. Donate 25,000 credits to the cause. I don't think so. Planetary scan job. Ooh, oh, I've got to be ranked higher than I am. Disable the mega ship turrets. 860. No, that's not right. 229,000. Wow. Bit of mining. We might have a crack at mining today if we can get uh, a new ship with the appropriate equipment. I don't think we've got anything here. No jobs whatsoever. This is a dangerous planet. We need to get off this planet, I think. Let's instead look at the commodities and just see... So this is the closest one. We'll just have a look here and see if we can make any credits on anything. 460, 400, nothing really special. Nothing outstanding. Are any of these things cheap? Oh, that's super cheap. Clothing. Oh, clothing? I've been looking for clothing for such a long time. I've actually found clothing. Oh, hang on. Oh, I've got some cargo. I've got some cargo. I've got some algae. How much did I buy the algae for? Uh, oh, well, that's not too bad. 2,896 credits of profit. Oh, incoming message. I suppose we ought to go check that out. But I definitely want some clothing. Let's go check out this message real quick. Promotion to Peddler. What? Good job, Commander. Your trading prowess has been noted and the Pilots' Federation has advanced your trade rank to Peddler. Nice. Pretty good stuff. Okay, then. Let's grab some clothes and go make some huge profit. Because I know, I know that there are people paying like 800. Uh, oh, had some hole damage. Uh, I know people are paying like 800 uh, credits for clothes at the moment. So I'm going to try and grab a bunch. That'll make us quite a few pennies. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Okay, let's uh, let's try and remember who was buying the clothing. Import price. That's what we're interested in. So they're going to pay eight hundred credits for clothes. So that's not a that's not going to be a bad. Uh, 
a bad return on our investment there. It's pretty darn close as well, so it should be easy. And whilst we're sort of cruising around, I'll have a look at all the new options and all the new menus and stuff. And Hopefully somebody somewhere will teach me how to, uh, how to buy a new ship, because I'd like to buy a new ship. But I'm not entirely sure how you figure out where you get a ship from. It's obviously some sort of ship seller somewhere. So, SciTech side panel is absolutely brilliant for takeoff, I've got to tell you. Look at that. Dead straight. Only gear retracted. It's been a while since I played, so uh, is that the ground I'm looking at? It is, isn't it? <laughs> this is a dark planet. This is a very dark planet. Pilots Federation promotion to peddler. Nice. This is only like the second or third time I've taken off from a planet, so uh, I'm a little bit learning as I go here. Cellus Primus is the other side of the planet or something? It's exactly the opposite way of the way I'm facing. I'm a bit thumbs and fingers at the moment. Oh, here we go. I see it. Stay out of the orbital pull. You can't believe the time on the game is the same as it is in the UK. Holy cow's milk, it is. There she is. Marcellus Primus. Damn, this looks good. Foster Research Lab. I just realized that the music is back. I'm, pre I'm pretty damn sure I turned that off. I don't know that I mind it, though, to be honest. I quite enjoy it. Oh, new bloop coming up. One magnificent new bloop. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, it's a proper good one. Have I done it again? Surely not. Surely not twice. 
Come on, slow down, god damn it. Oh my word. I'm going to have to change these button configurations because the problem is, and you can probably see it now on the throttle here, that the, um, the FSD button to engage and disengage... Where am I going? What the hell am I doing here? The FSD button to engage and disengage is here. And um, that's underneath all of this. So it, when I try and pull that back and flick that at the same time, I'm kind of getting my thumb trapped underneath, which is causing me not to pull the throttle back properly. So um, other than the fact that I should only be sort of doing 75% and sticking it in the blue, uh, that's my excuse. But uh, yeah, I think I might... I think I might change that button configuration because it's not comfortable. So, first change coming up. On the left hand panel we have now got a different layout completely. Uh, loads of uh, iconography I suppose you'd call it as opposed to textual information that used to be there. And docking is now within contacts, which has moved over one, uh, and it's just, just there. We're actually really close to that. I need to quickly remember how not to crash. Whew. So there's our first change. My God, doesn't this look vibrant now? Looks absolutely amazing. Okay, let's get that down. Is it landing bay two? It is landing bay two, which is that one. Landing gear deployed. Stone dogs, thank you for the salute. Welcome to the stream. I wish you could adjust the uh, the speed at which that vertical ascension came down because that's just too fast. We need some sort of um, thingies. What are they called? Clearing the hangar, uh, clearing the landing bay, so other people can land. Andrew Boyle, you've never played Elite Dangerous. Are you kidding me? I can't really say much because although I bought this when it first came out, I didn't play it for ages. It, literally about a month ago I started playing. But my God, there is so much here to enjoy. This, uh, I think at the moment, what I'm enjoying is the experience of uh, playing like Euro Truck Simulator but in space that's kind of how it feels even the dates right apart from the year how can you see the oh yeah 12th of december that's awesome i assume then that they've i assume then that that's part of the update as well i didn't know that was going to happen actually pretty sure it used to be all wonky but i could be wrong I've not been paying that much attention to the date but that is cool to have it as accurate as that you enjoy watching more well you can't argue with that can't argue with that I do you know I can sit and watch uh, what's his name obsidian ant uh, really well known for elite dangerous videos I can just sit and watch him playing for ages he's a very chilled out chap which helps far more chilled out than I am uh, and yeah it, I could just sit and watch him play for absolutely hours although normally I never have anything negative to say about Obsidian Ant but last night he was doing a live stream and I was like oh wow he's got like early access or something to Elite Dangerous because all the servers went down and he was just playing a video in the background and just chatting to people which is okay but for some reason it, you know the, the stream did sound like uh, he was playing the game 
And I was interested to see what he was going to show. I mean, he wouldn't show anything he's not already shown, I guess, but... Yeah, I was a bit disappointed. The date was always there, was it, Stone Dogs? Ah, uh, okay. Oh, thank you, Andrew. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go Starport Services. I'm a complete and utter noob in comparison to the likes of Obsidian Ant, but... Um, yeah, watching watching a lot of his videos has really got me excited for this game. I'm just totally immersed in it right now. Looking to enjoy far more content creation than I've currently been making. So, we've got eight tons of pesticide. And they'll buy them for 783, which is a little bit less than what we wanted to sell them for. But that's still like 6,000... Profit? No, it's not 6,000 profit. It's 4,000 profit. Why is that so low? Oh, that's pure profit. Okay. So they're going to pay 6,000, but obviously I've got to take my costs out of that. Okay, that makes more sense. This is not the way to make money. My ship is too small. Um, although, you know, 540 credits profit is better. Although I don't think that is profit, is it? No, it's not. That's a bit better. 770 credit. But then that's expensive. What have got to be wary of? Oh, that's better. That is better. Personal weapons. Produced by high-tech, industrial and military. Consumed by all. Legal in feudal, dictatorship, cooperative, communist and independent corporate governed worlds. Personal firearms designed for both self-defense and offense. But intended to kill a human attacker. Illegal or highly controlled in many jurisdictions. Export to Iran in. So what I need what I need to figure out. Go slow and steady and earn the credits, yeah. Yeah. That's the way. That's the way to do it. What I need to figure out is whether Iran in is uh one of those places that will allow weapons like that that's a run in there oh wow they pay more money as well they'll pay 900 for clothes so I could do that same route again Will they pay 720 so th there's a little bit of money to be made around 890 boil terminal they'll pay lots more but when I can only carry eight units it kind of does limit the amount of profit I can make I guess uh, so let's have a look see here um, system map I guess that'll tell me Freeport, Tehran Colonial Forces. So that's okay then. We can go in and sell weapons there without any issue at all, I think. Colonial Forces, that's pretty much what it said, wasn't it? If I remember correctly. Oh, we're looking at, looking at Dehan. Yeah, Dehan. Oh, that's different. There's a lot of information here. Hey, Josh. I am good, thank you. How are you, buddy? I hope you're in the Christmassy mood. I'm getting really Christmassy. It's only two weeks to go. Very excited. Very excited. I'm going to take a bit of time off over Christmas, by the way, guys. Um... I don't know if I've mentioned it or not. Yeah, I'm going to take I'm going to take two weeks off over Christmas. Uh, no streams, but there will still be videos. So uh, just to prep and prepare for 2019, we're just going to see some significant changes in the channel format. I haven't quite ironed everything out yet, but uh, 
yeah, it's going to be different next year. It's going to take a bit of time to set that up. So uh, just a quick heads up there whilst I was thinking about it. Personal weapons to Dehan. Okay, let me just double check that. So Dehan is over here. Dehan. I'm confused by that. I can never tell if that's on or off. So, export profit to Dayhan. It was already showing me Dayhan, but it was telling me that it wasn't in the list. That does confuse me sometimes. Okay, right. So, Dayhan needs to be one of those systems, and then we're good. I wish there was a close window script, like a little X there to close this. Because it gets in the bloody way. <sighs> Quite irritating. Is that Dayhan? So show me Dayhan's system map and tell me what kind of system that is. It's a high metal world content. Where do we go then? Dayhan gateway? Probably there. Confederation of Dehan. Oh, I don't know. See if there's any missions instead. Missions are safer. And they actually earn you more money as well. You're drinking a nice Christmas gingerbread latte. Oh, fair play to you, sir. I've got myself uh, a little Tassimo latte right here. Which I think uh, I think I'll have a sip of right now. Cheers. Keep me awake. Christmas is very nice, a family time, and all relaxed. Yeah, especially when you got little ones. The little ones just make Christmas so much better. Donate, donate, donate. No, I don't want to donate. Source and return six units of thallium to here. A hundred and thirteen thousand credits. Oh, I want to do that job. Source and return thirty units of conductive fabrics. This stuff has got to be hard to find, doesn't it? I need a pen and paper to write this stuff down. Thallium. All right, let's see if I can find some thallium. Is it a chemical or a metal? I think it might be a metal. Thallium. It is a metal. Uh, export price. Oh, hello. Hello, Iranin. So they sell it for 3,006 credits. Uh, and I think, what did it say? Uh, it was six, wasn't it? Andrew, you got your neighbour over this year, so that's a change. Oh, cool. It's good to have friends over. A little bit of a drinky poos. A little bit of music. A little bit of singing and dancing and messing about. It's all good stuff. Classic movies, guys. Classic movies for Christmas Day. For me, and I've, <laughs> I repeat this on a daily basis so that everybody in the house knows this is going to happen, but I will be watching The Great Escape. And whilst I'm watching The Great Escape, I won't be doing anything else. That's my thing. That's my Christmas Day thing. At some point during Christmas Day, I have to watch that movie and nobody's allowed to get in the way or stop me or ask me to do anything else them's just the rules does anyone else have a film like that when i was little little i think it was star wars but uh, that's that's what it's been for a good number of years now okay let's plot a route to that market bordage works let's add it to the list so if we can take some uh if we can take something there and make a profit on the sale 
we can pick that stuff up and make an absolute killing here. So now I'm excited. I think we found something that we can... Uh, source 6 thallium from a suitable market. Estimates cost Estimated cost 22,000. Well, we're going to get it for less than that. Convey the goods to Foster Research Lab in the Acellus Primer System. You will receive your reward upon delivery. Good luck, Commander. Nothing else particularly interesting to note there. We're going to take that on. And then we're going to come back out of here and uh, see if we can make some cash. Boardage works. That's where we're going, isn't it? Fantastic. Oh, look. We can make a thousand credits profit on consumer technology. Why are all of my alarm bells going off? For some reason, I feel like we're going to get ambushed. Like this is a, a, a complete setup. Resonating separators, structural regulators, personal weapons again. There's some serious profit on that. Personal weapons. Okay, so boardage. It's in the export list. So I'm guessing then boardage uh, will accept that without any issue whatsoever. Boardage works. Where's boardage works? Oh, come on. You're in the way. Hmm? Am I in the wrong one? Sometimes you can't get the thing to pop up. When you want it to pop up, it flipping well won't. <laughs> when you want it to go away... Iranian. Bordage works. Why can't I see that? As a barn. As a barn audible. Audible. Iranian, 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 Iranian. Okay, that's weird. Obviously doing that wrong. Evans, good afternoon. You just sent me a friend request. Oh, cool. A friend request on where? Steam? Elite Dangerous? Twitch? God knows. There's loads now. I'm losing track of everything. Andrew, for you, it's the Muppets Christmas Carol and Miracle on 34th Street. The black and white one. The black and white one? There's a black and white one? I didn't know that. But yeah, oh yeah, Muppets Christmas Carol. I, I have to watch that over Christmas, but it's not my Christmas Day must do. Oh, in-game, Evans. Cool. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll accept that in a bit when I figure out how to. <laughs> Appreciate the friend request. Thank you very much. Okay, let's just go. Let's just go to this place. Uh, I think we're going to try the personal weapons. This could all go horribly wrong. So that's 32,000. That's a third of our money invested. Cargo hold at maximum capacity. Oh, gosh. The nerves are jingling jangling. Top left. Yeah, I thought it was. Can I do it in-game game? In-game? In or do I have to... Uh, do I have to come out? Oh, Hello. Two pending friend requests. You have no friends online. Uh, it's not opening. Oh, I see. I was in the wrong thing. Evans. Hello, buddy. Akira. Akira Knight. Yeah, hello. Welcome. Cool. Accepted. Challenge accepted. <laughs> Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video today. I really appreciate you coming along and taking the time to do that. I want to say a big thank you to each and every one of you who watched this video today. Special big thank you to our Patreons and supporters on Twitch. But everybody who comes and watches, you all count. You are all part of this. 
and I thank you so much. If you hit that like button, I will like you twice as much. Even more than that, perhaps. It is for you guys that I make these videos, so it matters to me a huge amount if you enjoy watching them, and if you don't, you need to tell me. So thanks for watching, take care of yourselves. Until next time, goodbye for now.